Today we talk about life in the prairie. A prairie is a large, flat grassland found in regions with moderate rainfall and seasonal temperature changes. They are commonly located in the central United States, parts of Canada, and areas of South America, Australia, and Asia, with a diverse range of plants and animals. Here are some things you can see in North American prairies. Let's go! Bison are the largest land-dwelling mammal in North America and can weigh up to 2,000 pounds and run up to 35 miles per hour. Prairie dogs communicate with one another using a complex system of barks and even have specific calls for different predators. Pronghorns are the second fastest land animals in the world, capable of running 55 miles per hour and can maintain a high speed for long distances. Badgers have strong claws that allow them to dig burrows, sometimes extending over 30 feet in length, which they use for shelter and hunting. Ferruginous hawks can spot prey from up to two miles away while soaring high above the prairie. Meadowlarks are known for their distinctive, melodious songs of around 100 variation that are used to attract mates and mark territory. Great Plains toads can survive in very dry conditions by burrowing deep underground, where they remain inactive until it rains. Coyotes are highly adaptable and can thrive in various environments, from prairies to urban areas, and they often hunt in pairs or small family groups. A couple of prairie snakes include bull snakes, which are non-venomous snakes that are often mistaken for a rattlesnake and help control populations of small mammals like prairie dogs and rodents. Rattlesnakes are a venomous snake recognized by its rattle at the end of its tail. Let's mention a few special plants. Echinacea, purple coneflower, is not only a beautiful wildflower, but also has medicinal properties. It has been used by Native Americans to treat a variety of ailments, including colds and infections. Black-eyed Susan are known for its bright yellow petals and dark brown centers. This flower is a favorite of pollinators, especially bees, and is also the state flower of Maryland. Wild lupine is a nitrogen-fixing plant, which helps enrich the soil in the prairie ecosystem. It's also the host plant for the endangered Carner blue butterfly larvae. Purple prairie clover are rich in nectar and are a great food source for pollinators like bees and butterflies. They also help in restoring nitrogen to the soil. Lastly, we have rodents in the prairie, including moles, mice, ground squirrels, and others. They serve as a primary food source for predators like hawks, snakes, and coyotes. They also help aerate the soil by burrowing, which improves its fertility and ability to hold water and spread seeds, control insects, which help with plant growth. All right, that's an overview of prairie land and its wildlife. We hope you learned some cool new things. Thanks for watching. See ya!